How's it going YouTube? It is time to um, review my Duluth Trading Company Firehose Work Pants after a one year torture test. So I have a brand new pair here that we'll go over in a minute and I just wanted to show how these look after a year. Now what I did was order one pair and I decided to wear them to destruction and see how long it lasted and it came out to just about a year. Now you may be saying, how did a guy wear one pair of pants for a year? Well, um, I did quite a bit of laundry, um, but I would wear these maybe two days and then wash them. So they'd get washed two to three times a week. I uh, wore them five days a week, about eight hours a day, in some pretty grueling uh, working conditions. I'm an electrician and I'm often crawling through tight spaces, attics. And then of course I work in my bucket truck um, where I wear a safety harness that's always rubbing on it. and uh, I rub up against my tool bag and you know the edge of the bucket as I'm leaning for stuff. So I tend to destroy jeans. I've actually ripped jeans uh, beyond use in a single day before. That's why I ordered these. So uh, the material is a nice thick but soft um, stretchy material. They talk about it on their website quite a bit as being fairly indestructible. I didn't find it to be completely indestructible, but it did hold up really well. And uh, the first place that it started giving out was right here. And I think it was kind of ironic at uh, about 65 bucks a pair, these took a, took a swing at my wallet and my wallet fought back. So there was one item, the same shape, in there in that same spot every day, rubbing on the truck seat, rubbing on my safety harness. Um, so about 10 months into the year, uh, this finally let go. And, uh, I was pretty impressed with that. The button didn't come loose, but it was starting to pull through. Part of that was, uh, me getting a little bit fat this year. It's too much good home cooking. Uh, so I actually ordered an inch bigger on, uh, my new ones. And then the right knee gave out the other day. And that was when I decided to order another pair because these no longer reflect the professional image that I want to project to my customers. Uh, I just kind of looked down and I was like, oh, little hole starting. And then it went from there. And it's gotten it's gotten pretty thin right there. But the the amount of repetitive abrasive wear on these knees is pretty incredible um, this other side didn't go through they're a little thin there but they didn't go through um, my safety harness kind of loops through here and rubs on the knee there so uh, there you have it uh, you know the the cuffs held up really well the uh, pockets. I'm always reaching in out of my pockets. They got a little bit frayed. But there it is, folks. One pair of pants almost every single day for a year. I'd say that's pretty impressive. Definitely a pair of jeans wouldn't have lasted that long. So I went ahead and ordered two this time. So I'll keep those old ones for working around the house. But you can see here, these are the same, uh, <laughs> same color. Uh, dark brown, so they do they do fade a little bit over time. But here's the new pair, and uh, I'm pretty excited about them. The two things about these pants, uh, the crotch gusset, I really like this. I thought it was kind of a gimmick. They talk about it on the website, but what it does is it allows you to take bigger steps than you can in a pair of jeans. Basically, uh, my own flexibility and dexterity is the only thing that limits what kind of step I can take, not my pants. You don't get that bunched up uh, feeling if you take a big step. Uh, the other thing I love about them is the cargo pockets. Those are my two favorite things about these pants. Uh, nice roomy pockets um, and the crotch gusset. Uh, of course, they have the double stitching on all the pockets and then uh, triple stitching so I had absolutely no problems with anything letting go if I had uh, any complaints on this they're pretty simple this little pocket here is supposed to be for a cell phone but we've all seen 
what modern cell phones look like and it doesn't fit in there. So you end up putting the cell phone in a different pocket. Uh, and then the other thing, I'm going to demonstrate real quick, they actually talk about how deep the pockets are. Um, they, they advertise that as an advantage. But the problem is they're so deep that they, they kind of go under the top of the cargo pocket. So if you have something big in your pocket and stuff in your cargo pocket, it's like this giant lump right here. So if if I were Duluth, I'd limit the uh, the pocket to say right about here, uh, so you don't have that interference issue. But other than that, I am super pleased with them, and uh, I think these ones are going to last a couple of years because I'm going to rotate them. I'm not going to wear the same exact pair every day. But anyway, thanks for watching. Um, highly recommend.